Today we're going to be changing the automatic transmission fluid in our 2007 Honda Ridgeline 3.5 liter V6 and we're going to be using the recommended Honda Genuine automatic transmission fluid. This is the only recommended fluid to be used in Honda transmissions. To get started, I'll put the truck up on jack stands just so it'll be easier to get up under it and drain the fluid. Alright, the first thing we're going to do here is pull out the dipstick a little bit just to break the seal around it. Three things you're going to need to drain your transmission fluid. It's a drain pan. You're going to need a 3 8 ratchet or a breaker bar. I would recommend a breaker bar. I don't have one so I'm going to be using my 3 8 ratchet and a cheater bar. The drain plug location looking at the left front tire coming up under the truck to the transmission. It's located here on the bottom of the transmission on the driver's side. Okay, we've got our drain pan in place. I'm going to put a ratchet into the drain plug. Make sure you get it seated in there real good. That's to not strip it out. I'm going to run my ratchet as far up toward the front as I can get it. Slide my teeter pop on. Loose. After you break it loose, take it the rest of the way out by hand. Let it drain. You'll notice that when you take the drain plug out, it's got a magnet on it. It collects all the shavings from inside the transmission. And while you're waiting on the fluid to drain, you want to get something and wipe this off. Let's clean it up. After we finish draining, we'll let's reinstall that drain plug. Just tighten it up real good, hand tight. That'll be good. I'm going to fill it here on the driver's side, top of the transmission. See, we've got a fill plug down here. Right there, it is marked ATF. I think that is a 17 millimeter. We'll get us a socket, some extensions, and a ratchet pull that out. Now in order to gain some room I'm going to be taking off my air filter box, breather tube. These fasteners to hold the breather box on are 5 sixteenths.
that would also be a good time to change your air, air filter if you were due for one. There we go. And again, once it's broke loose, it is pretty easy to take the rest of the way out. There we go. We'll put our funnel. Oh, be careful. It also has a curse washer down here. We'll put our funnel down in the fill hole. After four quarts, it is rooting full. So now we're ready to put our fill plug back in. Start it by hand. Tighten it back up. And that is how you replace your automatic transmission fluid in a Honda Ridgeline.